Vortex party now, it seems. We gotta uh, get Kate. Uh, she may be in a bit of bother. You know what's so strange? Uh, in episode 3, they did that whole ending thing, and then they sort of got rid of that idea very quickly in episode 4 this episode. With, you know, the whole thing with uh, Chloe. And then we've went back to this normal version of Chloe. I don't know, it's a bit... Hmm, I feel like they tease too much with that. Tell me, guys, tell me how you guys feel about it. I'm a bit flustered on it. I'm with you to the end, Chloe. You know that. I thought it was an interesting spin-on of, of events. And we didn't really have opportunity to explore it. Like, all the other characters, like Nathan and Victoria, we could have got some interesting information about them and more perspective on those characters. Because we're, we're friends with them, with them in that universe. Oh, shit. This is like that eclipse. You're right. Look at the outline. I can't tell if they're different. What is that? that? Can't be two moons. Jesus, Chloe, look up at the sky. Oh my God! It's beautiful. I don't give a shit. Two moons. The world it is seems ending. cool. You're not listening. Something major is going down. That's right. Nathan Prescott is going down. Please, please. I hope this makes sense at the end. Welcome to the end of the world, ladies. I'm glad you decided to escort me. You look really good, Warren. Are you alright after today? I'm glad you stopped me. Nathan is dangerous. Where is he? I didn't see him at the dorm again. What's he got in his cup? In I saw a little um, greenness in it. Have you been drinking? Well, if you consider half a beer drinking. Let's go, Max. Hey, hey. Did you see that? It's green. I know this is a bad time, but. Can I get one picture? I've been feeling like this might be actually the end of the world, so I want to have something for prosperity. Well, I don't blame you, Warren. I know, I know. I'm pain in the booty. Just one picture. Uh. Action. I was gonna say it didn't no seem like it took the picture because it didn't make that sound. Sorry. I just wanted to feel like a normal student after this week's ultra violence. I never hit anybody like that before. I was always the one getting my ass kicked. Hey, we still need your expert help. If you see Nathan, text me immediately, okay? And do not let him see you. He won't. I know how to be invisible here. Not to me, Warren. Text soon. Take it easy, Warren. Don't drink too much of that green gunk. Or you might be next. That would be unfortunate. Right, uh, we're gonna stop right here. Not the, the video, but I need to turn this volume down because it's, I don't know why, it seems insanely loud to me. Um, don't worry, I'll probably tweak it for you guys so it isn't, you know, crazily low. I just assumed that it would be really loud because it's a party and it's already been loud, it feels. So I've turned it down for myself. Alright. I don't think we have uh, any time to party, so... Well, we really shouldn't. We should be... Get going with things. For uh, the, the sake of Kate. No thanks, Stella. Have you seen Nathan yet? No, thank God. That boy creeps me out. Wait, some girl just asked about Nathan before you came in. Oh, who? What girl? What girl? She had blue hair, dressed like a punk. Oh, Chloe. I've seen her putting up those Rachel Amber posters. I'm stuck here, so I'm sorry I can't help you. So why are you working at a Vortex Club party? I didn't think you wanted to be a member. Screw that. I'm here for the job. Anything unusual? Do you notice anything unusual about the Vortex Club tonight? Yeah, I noticed they don't give a shit about Kate Marsh. I'm oh. glad for the job, but I think Principal Wells should have cancelled the party. Guess I'm not cool enough. Yes, you are, Stella. You're smart, honest, and you bust your ass for Blackwell. I hope everything turns out your way in the end. Well, thank you, Max. Well, that was very really sweet of you to that. say that, Max. Hey, your face looks so intense. Are you it's okay? good to be randomly kind, no, you know that? I'm actually not okay. I, I just need to find 
You should uh, take soup from Max. Sometimes. There was one time, like a couple of parts ago, where she was a bit reasonable about uh, Nathan's dad. She kind of slanders about that, and it wasn't like I wasn't too fond of that. I thought that was uh, uncalled for. Oh, this is where the party is. Right, the, the pool's right in the middle. Jeez. It's a bit of a weird location for a party. Imagine the ideal one. But you'd think everybody would be in the pool, though, if it's taking up that much space. Don't know if I'm going to be monetizing this video with the music playing. We'll see. It's not that big of a deal, to be honest. Don't feel sorry for me, it's fine. Oh, okay, yeah, there's more people in the pool. Oh, I don't know why it zoomed in like that. I guess they really wanted me to see that person fall in the pool. Oh, that's horrible. No, 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 we have to stop that. I think we can stop that, maybe. It's Warren out. Warren! It's a shame she's always uh, like prone to get hurt and stuff <laughs> in every episode, it seems. What can you tell us? Uh, let's get... Wait, 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 where's Victoria? We want to know where Victoria. What are you playing at? Let's just talk about Vortex Club. Look at this. I'm at my first and only Vortex Club party. I know. This week was so shitty that I just wanted to be around a bunch of people trying to have a good time. Even if I hate most of them. Yes. Wait, what? Victoria. Victoria doesn't seem to hassle you like she does me. Or Kate. She must know I punch her in the face. I love to Vortex Club posterity. She's also always getting into that bother herself, so. I'm assuming Victoria just thinks herself, ah, what's the bother? I can just bother somebody else that's not getting themselves hurt all the time. Yes, Nathan, Alyssa, tell me more about him. I have to find Nathan. Have you seen him? I really don't know, but ah. section, Oh, like you're probably spot on there. Thanks, Alyssa. Watch out for yourself. Why, when I have Max Caulfield at my side? Good luck. That's true. But yeah, just just be careful. Just don't stand there when there's people behind you. That would uh, be a bit obvious. Oh, how are we gonna get in here? Sneaking slowly. Oh, can we just do that? We don't even have to talk to them. Sweet. Are they in the VIP club? Are we in the VIP club? It's a bit weird to imagine this is the VIP club, the bathroom. Yo, maximum overdrive, about time you got here. Everybody loves giving Max a nickname. Wanna get ripped? I kinda wanna list all the names. It's kinda insane. And not happy. Why did you even come tonight? Your face looks so fucking intense. <laughs> Why is everyone saying this? Oh, I'm an idiot. The VIP room's over here. No wonder they didn't. Say stop right there. Uh, I could just jump in the pool and then go over that way. Hey, how can I get in? But I'm going in. Sorry, but this is the VIP section. Members only. Okay? I don't give a shit about being a member. I just want to talk Victoria to Victoria specifically told me not to let you in. Nice try. Too bad you're not a member. Oh, great. No, you listen. Courtney is supposed to be the VIP gatekeeper, not me. So please go. Oh, Courtney. Hey, Courtney. How are you? Uh, what is Max Caulfield doing at a Vortex Club party? <laughs> it really must be the end of the world. <laughs> Get it? But seriously, like, what do you want? I didn't want to be alone tonight after this week, so I thought it'd be nice to hang out in the VIP section. Yes! Yeah, get me in there. Can you get me in there, please? Club, which you're not, and will never be. So, Okay. Great plan, Max. Time to find another way into the VIP section. 
Can you help me, Daniel? Hi, Daniel. Yes. I don't yes, imagine so because we managed to convince him to come here. And I don't know if he would be here if he wasn't motivated to come here. Have you seen Nathan Prescott tonight? No, I've been hanging with Brooke since I got here. Max, are you okay? Your face looks so serious. See, more of this. Can you believe it? It's nothing. It really isn't. It's just my face. It's nothing. It's just a residue from all the Blackwell drama. It seems like it never ends, huh? This is where it's going to end. For Rachel's sake. Oh, Max, you need a Blackwell brave. I'm taking Brooke to a Miyazaki show in Portland. If you want to come along, the more the merrier. Thanks, Daniel. I have to stay on my mission now. I hope you stay on yours and become a great artist. Well, I'll be celebrating someday in a museum, Max. Adios. I don't imagine Brooke's going to help us out. I'm kind of stumped on uh, how to get here. Oh, what am I... Jeez, I never knew we could walk around here. Is that going to be helpful at all? Yes. That was so simple. It's just up there. Oh, shit. Oh, no. We've messed up. Oh my god, DJ, you don't me out. We're gonna have to quickly rewind. Oh yeah, we're gonna have to quickly rewind. Hopefully we can move that speaker. I don't know if it's gonna be that easy though. Oh wait! Oh great, great. We just did that teleporting thing that we we've uh, we've done a few times.